Hey everybody, I don't know how well this is going to turn out. My picture looks pretty fuzzy when I look at it, but we're going to give it a try. So it's dawn again. I'm a little over nine months since my surgery, so I thought I'd uh, do a little update on my video. I've gotten some nice emails and even a card in the mail, and I appreciate that a great deal. One of the questions I got asked recently was, what was the hardest thing after surgery? And I probably have to say trying to sleep was the hardest. You know, at first getting up, moving around, just getting up and walking, um, all your daily take care of you kind of things is difficult. But probably the most challenging at first was sleeping. So that's what I have to say about initial stuff. Uh, now, nine months later, I'm still plugging along. Um, at six months, I saw the doctor, and I was really hoping he'd let me get back to Zumba because I was feeling pretty good, but the CT scan showed just some beginning uh, fusing, just a little, you know, trabeculae of bone in there, and he said it wasn't fusing good enough for me to do Zumba yet. So that was I was actually quite depressed, and that's why I didn't do a six-month video at the end of January. Um, went home and ordered some Domino's pizza, so that wasn't a good idea. So needless to say, I've still got my 25 pounds that I've put on after surgery. Um, I'm thinking about joining Weight Watchers to see if that might help. A um, little bit of accountability and, and some direction and losing weight. So if anybody out there has uh, experience with Weight Watchers and has any tips for me, that would be terrific. I'm back to work. I work 30 hours a week. That's what I was before surgery, so that's my full time and uh, back to seeing patients. I'm a physical therapist, if people will remember, and I do outpatient practice. So I'm not having to lift people out of bed or anything like that. So even though I am a physical therapist, there's not a ton of heavy lifting that I have to do. I do specialize in women's health um, and orthopedics, in case anybody was interested in that. And what else can I tell you? Well, I've been choreo I've been doing choreography. The other thing that I do is um, I do choreography for the local high school. And we just recently put on a musical. It was You're a Good Man, Charlie Brown. It turned out great. So that was a lot of fun. And then um, right now I'm working with the high school choirs, uh, 9th through 12th grade choirs. And they're, they always put on a spring show they call Coffee House. And it's a dinner and a show. And they do a lot of Broadway show tunes like South Seas, Cats, Oklahoma, Guys and Dolls. So there's just like a little um, variety pack of all kinds of different things. And so I, I go in with the choirs and, and teach some choreography for that. So I've been really happy that I've been able to do that. So life is doing really good. Um, been wearing a pedometer just to see how much I've been walking during the day. And I average about three to five miles. So that's, that's pretty good. Uh, the only problem I'm really having with my back is if I have to stand for a long time, let's say waiting in line for tickets or something like that, that just standing around, um, and that kind of just makes my back tired and achy and don't like that. The other thing that's hard for me now is uh, sitting for a long time in like folding chairs or the hard, you know, metal folding chair type thing. Um, if I have to sit too long in something like that, then uh, my feet will start burning. And occasionally I get a little ping of a little tingle or a little needle-like ping thing here and there. Very mild, nothing to complain about, nothing that I w would be worried about or want to have more surgery about or anything like that. So my goal is to try to take this weight off because I really don't want to have the surgery again. And you know, it, you really increase your chance of having another fusion if you've already had one. So my biggest goal is to try to protect, I think I've said that too many times, <laughs> my goal is to try to protect L5S1 so that I don't have to have surgery there. And one of the ways of doing that, of course, is keeping a healthy weight. So anyway, I'm uh, more than happy to answer anybody's questions. Uh, feel free to email me, um, post um, comments on this, on this video. And uh, best of luck to everybody. God bless. Bye-bye.